What's going on you guys? Welcome back to Channel Anderson. Today's video is the announcement of something different we're going to be trying this year. That's right, we are doing Vlogmas 2022. To be honest with you guys, I've never tried to put out daily content, so it's going to be a big challenge for me. But I promise I'm gonna do my best to not only put the videos out, but make sure that it's interesting stuff. That's, you know, it's fun for you guys to watch and entertaining still, not just trying to pump out videos. I think it'll be a fun challenge and I'm looking forward to it. So uh, that said, let's go ahead and get into it. What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel, Anderson. It's been a few weeks since I did a vlog, so I wanted to start off this week and get it going. So I have one for you guys. It's Tuesday right now. It's actually snowing today. So we're probably gonna have a little snow video here in the next few days uh, with one of the SUVs, or maybe in the near future. I don't know if it's gonna stick, but uh, I'm at my school right now. I'm a teacher for those that forgot or don't know yet. My full-time gig outside of YouTube, printing up some uh, cartridges for my students, some uh, Super Nintendo cartridges, and I'm about to head out. I'll show you guys what the snow looks like. And I'll give you guys a quick view of these as well. We got gray ones. These ones are like a uh, pearl blue, uh, so I'm giving them a variety but anyways a fun little project we're doing and uh snow outside it's a minimum right now it came down pretty good in the morning it was sticking but then it was raining a little bit not really sticking too much anymore so brought the ml55 today just in case so let's make our way home and i'll update you guys once i'm there well not much snow at all out here to be honest we'll see how it does tonight see if it freezes at all maybe i'll get a day off work if i'm lucky although i don't want to come in tomorrow because tomorrow's our half day but uh yeah let's go ahead and take this baby home driving the c55 anytime guys just made it home <laughs> here's the view of the other three nice little layer on the w124 <laughs> m163 didn't get driven today this thing i'm excited to try this out in the snow this year um, with the m155 all clear uh, hopefully we get some legit snow i can drive around in both the suvs but uh yeah i'll catch up with you guys in a little bit well guys that escalated quickly <laughs> actually it was a lot worse but uh it's been raining all morning so i still gotta go to work right now and uh no snow day no snow day from school it looks like so i was picking out which one of these has less snow in it to clear off i want to drive the ml63 in the snow but it's basically just slush now so i might just take the ml55 it's got a little less snow to clear off so all right guys we're all cleared off it's uh 37 degrees right now Let's make our way to work. All right guys, roads are pretty clear. Um, it definitely seems like in the last few years, Washington, uh, at least in this area, um, has gotten a little more like proactive about uh, keeping the ball rolling when we get hit with snow. Um, as before, I don't know, when I was a kid, I remember being up here, even if it was just like this, how it is now, like there would have been no school anywhere. Um, but uh, even I was checking around the, the state today and there was like mostly just two hour late starts, if anything, or just nothing. So um, yeah, just different perspectives thinking about it now as an adult. But uh, yeah, this is all clear out on the roads, even the big hill that I just passed. There's a tree that fell down, so there was a team over there trying to take care of that, but like it, the hill was already cleared of snow, so they must have been at it through the night uh, or as soon as they could in the morning or whatever, but yeah, it's 6.45 right now. I've been up since like 4.30, 5 o'clock. Uh, at that time, there was still a lot of snow, but um, it was raining pretty fast, so melted down quick 
anyways, I will uh, check back in later on. Well guys, I probably should have driven the ML63 so I could have tasted a bit of snow with it, but <laughs> yeah, it's uh, starting to come down now. It was actually super heavy a little bit ago, but it's supposed to basically snow from now till like all through the night. So maybe we'll have a snow day tomorrow, we'll see. But uh, I'm just cleaning up here. It's my classroom for those that haven't seen it. And uh, I'm gonna head out in a second. Before I head out, I wanna show you guys a little Mac station we got set up here. I'm a Mac user. Unfortunately, our school has a contract with, well, I'm fortunate, but we have a contract with Microsoft. So we're supposed to use PCs and Windows and all that stuff, but we were able to get this uh, for a former student of mine who's now here interning, um, doing some music production, and also a couple current students are using this setup. But uh, yeah, it's my side hobby kind of passion that you guys don't see much. But for those that don't know, I usually make most of the music that you guys hear on the channel. Um, and I wanted to show you guys, here's the Nintendo cartridges. That's what I'm printing on the 3D printer right now. I'm doing some different colors, uh, classic gray. We'll do some white. I'm doing the clear ones right now. Um, they basically designed some retro game concepts. We're gonna put them on some vinyl stickers and then put them on there. They'll be able to take them home, have something cool for themselves. I'll show you guys what it looks like right now. Printing compared to where it started this morning in the clip you guys saw. There it is, this one is about halfway through. Got another four hours to go. So we'll catch that tomorrow if we're here, otherwise uh, Friday, but let's go ahead and head out and uh, see what kind of snow we run into. All right guys, we're ready to roll. Bye bye snow. Let's do this. All right, guys, it was a pretty uneventful drive home. It's pretty much a slush. It's not like real snow driving on anyway. So I'll definitely get it in the video if there is a chance to take the ML63 out, uh, out in the snow and try it out for the first time. It's on the list, definitely. I know you guys have been curious to see it. There's been people messaging me about getting that thing out in the snow. Um, so I'll definitely do so, just not yet. I think right now um, I might clear off the E420 and move it over to the spot to the right over here just so that i don't know people are trying to turn people are trying to turn that corner right there and i just don't want to leave it sitting on the open right there so might clear it off and move it here in a second and uh while the snow is here i'm thinking about even pulling the intake manifold off of the c55 uh just so i can have something to mess with inside the house while it's down anyway it's not gonna be driving it so yeah i'll uh, update you guys next part of the video all right, we got the E420 started up. Just gonna see if I can get it moved. Supposedly these things are pretty good in the snow. The W124 chassis is known for being a very good sedan in the snow, uh, but I've never driven it in the snow. I think actually that when it was still automatic, I think I did one time, but not a lot. All right, well guys, it's the next day. I didn't film while I was moving the E420, but it did okay. I was sliding out a little bit, but got it into position. And uh, yeah, even if I had to drive this thing in the snow, I feel like it would do pretty good, to be honest. Um, yeah, uh, things I'm gonna show you guys real quick. I just got a few new catch cans from Flash Shark Racing. Uh, they're the black ones, so we'll check those out. And to close out this video, I think we'll be taking a look at those, going on a little adventure uh, in the SUVs. We gotta go grocery shopping, so go for a bit of a drive and uh, see what else we can throw in this video before we check out. All right, guys, we've got one of the goods. I think only one of them showed up so far. Another one will be here probably soon, but yes, go check it out. The snow always brings two feelings for me with the cars. Number one, I get excited because I get to rip around the SUVs, but number two, I get sad because I know I'm not gonna be driving this thing. <laughs> All right, guys, heading out to the store soon. Grocery adventures in the snow majees. <laughs> uh, I'll get a startup clip. Ultimate cold start. <laughs> What a beast. 
and that is with a catless no resonator M155 sounds like <laughs> We'll do this one later. We kind of heard that one. We are not going to do the C55. Alright guys, hopefully you got an okay view. I don't think it's going to be uh, too climactic. Just ice in our neighborhood and then the roads are probably all clear. Which yeah. Let me know. Vlog, Miss Baby. Peace. 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 My son's saying peace to you guys. The camera's pointing the other way, buddy. <laughs> Why? <laughs> exactly. See, I told you when you flip it, then it works. Did you see that? <laughs> You're always telling me that it was my crusty old phone. All right, here goes the ice. Oh boy. Hey, Chico Chai, please. Oh my gosh. What? Right, we're good. Then. Oh this bad boy's a tank. So yesterday, by the way, I should have recorded it when I was backing out the E420, but there were some guys in our neighborhood that were uh, asking me if I wanted to push, and I was like, no, I got this. <laughs> so I was jamming it back and forth, reverse first. Stalled the car one time, and I finally got it. Fruit and vegetables. That's all you were thinking about. <laughs> well, I mean. What else were you thinking about? Fritz. Well, guys, um, as you can see, nothing too interesting. There's no snow on the road, so I'll probably check back with you guys later. But, uh... All right, you guys, we just got to the grocery store. We got a super nice grocery outlet that's nearby us, um, so we just use this one most of the time. But update on the MO55, it's had this crack for a long time in the windshield um, but it's basically just sat right here and never progressed but I just noticed it uh, definitely progressed last night in the cold so hopefully it just goes and connects to that side and can uh, keep running it for now but I'll definitely get a new one eventually it's just not a priority compared to other things we got going on what's up buddy you want to miss this one yeah sure my son what? likes uh, pushing all the buttons in the car. That's a DVD player. I don't even think uh, it might work actually. We haven't tried in a while, but well, it's not on right now. Oh, I think he just turned it on. Yeah, somebody put this in at some point. I don't know if this could have been a factory option. I guess it has this nice trim piece, but I don't know to be honest with you guys. But anyways. Uh, I think the next thing I'll show you guys when we get back to the house, I'll update you guys if the catch can has uh, collected anything. Uh, and then I do have a trick for the check engine light, but I haven't got the resistor yet in the mail. So once I get that, I will uh, update you guys with that too. Alright, my wife just got the goods. Got some juice. She's always getting us little treats. Soul tea. It yeah, what's up? Lemonade, strawberry one. Lemonade, strawberry one. Mine is dragon fruit super aid, new and improved. Taste test. What do you think, guys? Ooh, from my from my home, San Diego. In case you guys didn't know, that's where I'm from. Taste test, guys. You want to drink it too? You want to drink it over here? Okay, careful, careful. Here, let me hold this. <laughs> All right. Not a 10 out of 10, but... Uh, it's just like a... It's just like a healthy little thing. <laughs> Sour? <laughs> I was kind of thirsty though, so it's good. Yeah, I got quite a bit of drinks in my mind. Be healthy, chaps. <laughs> But this one, guys. That's good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> this one's good. But I like lemonade, everything. So. Dad, I died. <laughs> Maze wants it back. I want to 
Yes. We're gonna buckle you right Give us now. your review. Yeah, you give your review. <laughs> Come on, bro. Ooh, sour. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a golden boy right now, dude. <laughs> My wife forgot the uh, ground lamb. I'm trying to make some lamb burgers tonight. So. She volunteered to go back. Love you, babe. Say, love you, mom. Love you, mom. <laughs> Anyways, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. You guys just watched the catch cam video you guys know my son was asking about the total wine story he's asking about it again we told him that's uh big people juice he doesn't drink yet anyways we're back at wajimaya gonna go get some uh little snacks that we didn't pick up you know in the normal grocery run and now we'll head back home and uh get a few more clips and i'll be editing this video so you guys can see it today same day video it's gonna need some hustle for me to do this vlogmas properly. We'll see if I can make it happen. All right, you guys, latest obsession, milk tea. I used to drink this stuff like so much when I was in my teenage years and my son now loves it. So he got me back into it. Yeah, I like Misubi. Yeah. <laughs> I got two milk I got two milk teas make you guys hungry right now. Which one are you gonna get? All right guys, making our selection slowly. Love grabbing these, throw on with some uh, rice or noodles. Got some sushi, the Misubi Spam. Just checking all the different selections love this store every time we come in there's just so many like foods that we like number one and just all kinds of little stuff that it's hard to find elsewhere so it's cool to come in here but uh hard to leave without spending a bunch of money <laughs> oh, yeah, all right guys grocery haul all done i like these lexus trucks right here for those that don't know i'm kind of a toyota fanboy too and honda fanboy but you know i just don't like hondas because it gets stolen but I do love them. <clears throat> Anyways, make our way home. One other thing before I forget too, shout out to uh, Lewis from Clutch Kick. They shot the C55 video, you guys know. Um, he told me about these Ram mounts. These things are super nice. That's what the GoPro is hooked up to right now. Work just super well, like nice and convenient. Just twist lock it to get the suction and super strong. So definitely a go-to from now on. All right guys, back home now. Son fell asleep, so I just took him in. I gotta grab the rest of the groceries, but real quick, wanted to uh, check with you guys to see if we got anything in the catch can showing up yet. Probably not, but. Let's see. something all right well still very low but that's cool it's doing his job nice 
All right, guys, last little thing before we end uh, Vlogmas day one. Go ahead and open up this catch can. See what the uh, difference is. I mean, it's just black versus silver, but let's see how it looks. All right, guys, so here's what the kit looks like when you get it. Got your catch can. This looks nice and black. Very cool. I'll put my own uh, filter material like I made for the other ones. Comes with this hose. I'm just going to keep this around for some miscellaneous jobs that'll come in handy, I'm sure, at some point. But besides that, all the fittings. And yeah, pretty straightforward. Just like the other ones. If you haven't checked out those videos, go check them out. There's one for the C55 and for the ML55. And coming up soon will be for the E420 and for the ML63. That being said, that'll go ahead and do it for this one, you guys. Uh, I've never tried Vlogmas before. We'll try our best to uh, get a video out every day and keep it, you know, actually interesting stuff, not just making a video to make a video. Um, so, yeah, today was just kind of to kick it off and let you guys know what's going to be going on. And we'll see what kind of adventures we have for the rest of the month up until Christmas uh, for those that celebrate that. And anyways, I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Peace. Thank you.